Good morning, my name is Bob, and I'm the owner of the collection of this motorcycles. Uh, I'm a private collector, and as you can see, uh, enjoy bikes. Uh, today I'm going to show you a 1964 Honda 305. My understanding was factory-sponsored race bike. Uh, the unfortunate story about this is that uh, when I bought the bike, in my enthusiasm, the gentleman explained everything to me about the race history and who rode this bike and never wrote any of it down and got co so consumed with getting the bike uh, that after a while I completely forgot and uh, have no access to getting that information. So I'm sorry in advance for not being able to give that to you, but I think anybody who knows bikes would know and see that uh, that particular tank, which is a hand-fabricated tank, uh, is not something you just pick up at a local uh, art gallery. Um, anyway, there's uh, nothing real noteworthy to point out as far as uh, flaws in the bike. Uh, it was a race bike. My guess is, from what I remember, is that the gentleman who had the bike, who was not the one who raced it, um, I took it and cleaned it up and made it look like a nice bike, and which it does. Uh, Akron rims, front and rear, uh, the motor, 64, those were uh, Kickstarter backwards, not forward, or forwards, excuse me, meaning this way, down instead of back. Uh, my understanding is that the motor was bored. Uh, it's got a lot of work done to it. Can't confirm any of that. Uh, I did start the bike and run it uh, two and a half, three years ago and rode it. It runs great. Uh, I'm going to do a start run on it here in a few minutes, but um, I'm not going to ride it because I don't want to put any fuel in the tank. It takes a lot to clean the tank out and have no fuel in it whatsoever, and I've had it on display, and my guess is maybe somebody else would as well. Uh, so without further ado, uh, I'll go ahead and start the bike. It, it does start easily. So that's as much as I'm going to do because, as I've said, I'm not going to take it out riding and put fuel in the tank, uh, but uh, it does run excellent. So for those of you who are bidding, uh, it's a real fine example of a period race bike, uh, and uh, whoever gets it would be proud to display it, which I'm guessing most people would buy it and do that. So good luck on your bidding, 1964. Honda 305 race bike. 